Zaire, I want you to enjoy this. This is something that my mother, your great-grandmother, used to read to me, and um, I just want to pass it along. It's a poem uh, by uh, Edgar A. Guest, and it is entitled Being Brave at Night. The other night, about two o'clock, or maybe it was three, an elephant with shining tusks came chasing after me. His trunk was waving in the air and spouting jets of steam, and he declared he'd eat me up, but still I didn't scream. Or let him think that I was scared? A better thought I had. I'd just escape from where I was and crawl in bed with Dan. One time there was a giant who was horrible to see. He had three heads and twenty arms, and he come after me. And red-hot fire came from his mouth, and every hand was red. And he declared he'd grind my bones to make them into bread. But I was just too smart for him. I fooled him mighty bad. Before his hands could collar me, I crawled in bed with Dad. I ain't scared of nothing that comes pestering me at night. Once I was chased by twenty ghosts, all shimmery and white, and I just raced them round the room and let them think maybe I'd have to stop and rest a while and they could capture me. But when they leapt upon my bed, oh gee, but they were mad to find that I had slipped away and crawled in bed with Dan. No giant's ghosts or elephants would ever go in there, because if they did, he'd beat them up and chase them to their lair. they just hang round children's rooms and snap and snarl and bite and laugh when they can make them yell for help with all their might. But I don't ever yell out loud. I'm not that sort of lad. I slip from out the covers, and I crawl in bed with Dan. I hope you enjoyed it. I had fun making it for you. See you soon.